Uh, Alice in Chains was and still is one of my very favorite bands of all time. And um, I had this job where I was sweeping floors about 15 years ago. And that's already a bum out when that's your job, to sweep floors. And we're listening to the radio and uh, the rock announcer came on and said that Lane Staley had died. So you take, a, you take a really depressing mood and moment and then you amplify that by 10 and I just remember that such a drag and uh, the day just seemed to just to turn horrible um, because of the way his, his vocals uh, affected me and, and millions of others. You know, easily one of the most unique vocalists and lyricists ever of all time. So total bum out, but uh, wow, I can't believe it's been 15 years. I'm really proud of Allison Chains for sticking around and doing what they love to do and uh, giving Mastodon one of the best tours of our life five years ago when we went out on the Black Diamond Sky. So. Uh, much love to Allison Chains and Lane himself. There's something really special about Lane Staley's um, his vocals, especially with Jerry Cantrell. It's like a real eerie, almost uh, premonitional lyrics w with a lot of his songs. You know, listening back now after he's passed away, it's just like, you know, Man in the Box. Uh, it's, it's it's almost it's almost spooky. Super spooky. But uh, the, yeah, the combination of him, him and Jerry Cantrell singing together is some of the most awesome. I mean, I love the melodies and the, the vocal patterns and the, the harmonies when they would harmonize together. And uh, you know, the world really lost a, a true amazing singer that day. <laughs> ¶¶